I don't think that it <laughs> votes well for any party to start calling people names. No, I name, listen, name calling is, is never fun in, in, in politics. It actually d demeans your message, and I think you gotta just move on and talk about the facts. All right, well, here's the facts. When the president said that Republicans want dirty air and dirty water, when the president says, the president of the United States, Republicans want kids with Down to syndrome, autism, and the elderly to fend for themselves, and then complains that the Romney smear machine may be coming after them. I'm not concerned about the very poor. Wait a minute. Is, is that proper for the president of the no, United States not, to lie like that? <laughs> he that. did not say that. He said that. He said we do not have to settle for that. He didn't say that's not what he said. That. He said that he said that our changes do not necessarily mean we have to settle for dirty air, dirty water. But you know, the Republican but plan, their plan is dirty air and dirty water. And that's, that's what he said. Politics, because when you have the leader of the free world stand up there and say, in so many words, that's what Republicans want. Well, You're going to have certain people the, out there. It's not, it's, right, Jim. it's not just uh, the president. It's the whole Democratic. Uh, tactic what they do is they they accuse you of what they're doing i mean they're, they're, they're good at they're it doing it very good and they Democrats get a lot of they get a lot of help for from dirty the air our democrats are for proper regulation to make sure we don't have dirty Chris, air do you think i want dirty air and water absolutely do you not. think any republican wants dirty air or water Fuck Mexico! I, I do not do you think, think they do no they but, don't so the president right. purposely misrepresented so that he can score cheap political points that rep Horseshit. republicans yes. have too much faith in the private sector and they're willing to allow dirty air and dirty water which leads to that listen i've been to buffalo new york i've been to the towns outside Jeez, there so there have i chris i live air, in new york there's lots of dirty water there there's a whole town that's but Basically, the leader of the free world is using this as a political game so no, people this give is, him more support by Angela, saying that Republicans are bad. This is and a this policy. Is this is a policy uh, and I know discussion. I don't want to this is not a name-calling ex exercise. This is saying, hey, this is You're where right. I believe. Oh, you know what? I'll might, tell you one other thing. Take it lead. when Paul Ryan points out the obvious, which the president didn't have the courage to address and lead in the State of the Union about about Medicare, Medicare, which are going bankrupt, mention. like the country's going bankrupt. Doesn't mention it. You're right. And here's a Paul. Paul Ryan comes up with a plan, like it or not, and what do the Democrats do? They get a Paul Ryan look-alike, put an old lady in a wheelchair, and they throw her over the cliff. Well, is that is that is I've that how you're gonna? I want Paul Ryan to stay away from my grandmother for a very long time. <laughs> But if he really cared about the deficit and oh. debt, he, he would care. have voted for so Simpson Bowles when he had a chance. He was on care. the Simpson Bowles. That was the president's one. commission. He should have voted for it. He would have been the deciding vote. It was one vote away from being. Me, me, because it was flawed in some ways. Go ahead. You know what? You're, so you're saying in essence that Paul Ryan does not care about old people when he was. Does that cross a line for you? Do I throwing think... Granny over the cliff. Does that throw a line? Let's draw a line. Is that what over is the top? ad. I don't care. I'm asking you. Does that cross a line? Bottom line is negative. The problem. Even with negative ads in this in this world, so you're okay negative with it. ads work. Say it. You're okay I'm with it. I'm a political strategist. I've done I've done negative ads so, in my so life. It's gonna happen. Do you support it? I do. I you fucks. I hate you. I hate you both. I should fucking both. Just oh, right now, I should no. fucking kill you. Fucking both. Support it. Do I think it should? Do I think we? It should be. It's a lie that no. you support. I don't it's, think a lie. it's a lie. I think that you I think, think that Paul Ryan wants Granny thrown over a cliff in a wheelchair. His plan. So it is a lie. His plan basically is going to say, my grandmother, when your when your medical expenses that we give you a coupon for runs out you're on your own what does that mean to people living you know on what? In in this is all right so so colonel allen west congressman west says take their ideas and get the hell out of america unquote unquote he says their ideas all of a sudden you know in this moral you know outrage selective moral outrage all of a sudden you your fellow dems are all upset and i'm thinking if he says take these socialist ideas, these bankrupt ideas, these ideas of trillion dollar debts out of here, European socialism, why is everyone offended by that? Well, they, they shouldn't be. I mean, it shows the frustration of this guy, the 24-year uh, veteran of the United States Army, combat infantry Hero. leader. Hero. Uh, That's a great line. Hero. Yes, Angela. Master parachutist who's a patriot and is just, you know, his uh, tolerance level I, is, is reaching I, a, I'm not gonna, a peak. I'm not going to peak.
I'm not going to say anything bad about his record in the military or anything else about him, but his record as a congressman for the last year and a half has been horrible. But you know, and, he, and some of the things he's said has oh, been he, because he voted. Because he voted. That does not. He's a crybaby. Congressman Jim Moore ran the right because this black man apparently stepped out of line by saying the things that he said. It does not give Congressman Jim Moran the right to say that he doesn't represent the African American. Well, you're community. right about that. It doesn't give. Hey, the hey right Chris, to do you know who the biggest crybaby in Washington you gotta, is? You got to know Moran. Wait a minute. You know who the biggest crybaby in Washington is? Who's the biggest crybaby? Obama. Mitch McConnell. Obama. You want to know why Obama's <laughs> John a crybaby? John Boehner. He blamed. Well, oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll give you a little a little ground there. Thank you. But Obama blames the tsunami and he blames the, the, the earthquake and everything is responsible. President Bush. President Bush, talk radio, Fox, Carl Rove, Rush Limbaugh. <laughs>